Okay, Fire Techies, what we're going to do on today's video is we're going to get your script from your tablet to your modules. And you're going to need a couple of cables in order to do this. Um, you're going to need a micro USB B to a female type A connector. That's going to go to your tablet. And then you're going to need a male type A to a older type uh, B USB connector that will go to your module just like you would use on a PC. So you will plug those in together and start your power up process. Now you gotta remember with a FireTech system you always have to have a primary module or a master module. So what you're gonna do is start up your power up process and in order to get your module into master mode you're going to hold down the green button and flip it to test. What this will do is start your module out in a master mode and I always like to set my master module to module 1 and you simply just let off the green button and hit green for go. That's how I remember it. And now we have ID1 in master. Now if you remember our script has three modules in it and what we're going to do is I'm going to power on my additional modules here off camera um, just to make sure that we have a total of three modules that there are two additional slaves plus one module which is our primary and our application has now seen our, our main module and we are going to use it by default to use this as a USB device just giving it permission. Now on the top right hand of the screen you'll see a little envelope or I believe it looks like an airplane. You click this and we want to choose script upload to our modules. We hit OK and off she goes. Now if you didn't have all of your modules loaded on here it would give you an error saying that it did not find module 2 or module 3 or whatever module it was. So now you can see on our FireTech screen here on our main module that we have queues that it is requiring and there is nothing connected to these queues. So that is how you get a script from your tablet to your module. Now if you wanted to remove that it's as simple as going backwards is hit that button, script erase, hit OK and it now has removed the script from all of your modules. So on the next video we will start to get into the two-way information that it's, it provides you, some of the other features like arming and actually firing the script. So remember stay safe out there and have fun. Mm -hmm.